first start of the season for him. Strike one to RJ Austin, who's leading off for the Commodores. It's a freshman from McDonald, PA. Got it. First strikeout for Pitzer, one down. Far on the season, pitching out of the bullpen. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Tyler Pitzer. Doesn't have a hit yet in the series. Ground to the left side, into the shift. Tip it, off balance. Makes the play, and it's a 1-2-3 inning for Tyler Pitzer. He strikes out two. Popped him up. Vastine lost it in the sun, and it drops in for a hit. That's ripped to left. A base hit for Messina. Back-to-back -back singles here in the bottom of the first. He's off to a rough start here. That's line to center, and it drops in for a hit. Ethan Petrie drives in two, and South Carolina takes a two-nothing lead. See Petrie here just keeping his hands back, not a great pitch to hit, but goes down and gets it, and that's what we're talking about, Dave. I mean, he just he uses the whole field. It's really not one way you can pitch him. I mean, it's... Futrell is only play at first. The sacrifice successful from Lee Croy. Lined off of Futrell, it ricochets to Diaz, who goes home. And the tag is applied to Jones. They'll check on Futrell. Jackson takes off for second. High fly ball, left center. And drifting to left, and Leneve drops it! We look like we didn't know how to play baseball. Casas launches that to right. Goodbye! A two-run shot for Gavin Casas, his third home run of the year. And the Gamecocks are pouring it on here in the bottom of the first. That ball is hammered. I, I tell you what, I mean, it, this Gamecock team this weekend, I mean. And Futrell strikes out Tippett. The 3 2. Third strikeout for Pitzer. That's belted to left off the bat of Jones. And it's gone. Fourth home run of the season for Kennedy Jones. Second home run this afternoon for the Gamecocks. Well, Kennedy Jones just made the adjustment there. He saw that pitch about three or four times in the at bat and the win and you know a couple defensive plays have, have hurt Vanderbilt and extended innings for South Carolina and Petrie goes down swinging. Friday starter does well and you think, oh, okay, I can do this. Good play, Casas. Fair ball, Casas flips to Pitzer. It's another one, two, three inning for the freshman from Pennsylvania. It's to Alabama and, um, you know, they were winless. So. Reach on a fielder's choice. It's going to be for Futrell. Perfect bunt. What a play. Austin showing off some range over at first. Lined up the middle, it's a base hit. Lee Croy rounds third. He's coming home. An RBI for Dylan Brewer, and the Gamecocks take an 8-0 lead. High fly ball. Left field. Leneve, battling the sun, is able to come up with it. 
Strikes out Austin for the second time this afternoon. Earning an, another opportunity. Is, is pitching extremely well for South Carolina. First hit of the afternoon for Vanderbilt, Davis Diaz. It's ball four. First walk issued by Pitzer. Going to deliver for Vanderbilt, the one, two. Ground ball to short. Tip it will flip to second. Control. Top of the order. And that's off of Vastein. Nolan will reach for the second time this afternoon. You gotta try to just turn the page. And uh, you know, I talked about the that's a good read there by Parker Nolan. Ginther strikes out Messina. Back to back strikeouts for Ginther. Put Petri on. I don't blame him with first base open to go ahead and put him on and lines, but right at Vastine. Going the other way, a good piece of hitting by Troy Leneve. Leneve who had a multi-hit game in game two yesterday, picks up his first hit today. Five strikeouts, Pitzer wins the battle. He gets Polk. Six strikeouts and five shutout innings for Tyler Pitzer. He gets hit. There goes Tippett. Nolan up the middle. The only play is at first for Davis. Got him. Seven strikeout for Pitzer. Eight strikeouts for Tyler Pitzer. Back to back here in the top of the six. He gets Diaz, he gets Espinal. Call strike three. Been really, really good. Ground ball to short. Tippett lost the handle. The batter was hit by pitch. He will be awarded first base. Line over Tippett, it's a base hit. Davis rounds third. And he will score an RBI single for Matthew Polk and Vanderbilt is on the board. They trail eight to one. Take this in that series. And Becker strikes out Humphrey. What they have in their pitching staff. Vastine deposits that in left. An RBI single. Vanderbilt shortstop. Lifts that to short center. Brewer comes in and he makes the play. Fly ball left field, Leneve back to the track, to the wall, it's gone! A home run for Brewer, his third of the season. Third home run of the afternoon for South Carolina. They lead nine to two. Just lets that ball travel, lets it get deep, and that ball was up a good bit, all over the plate, got great backspin on it. Called strike three. Lebowski gets Casas. Becker gets Espinal, two down. Successful, he's always looking to get better. Called strike three, back-to-back -back strikeouts for Becker. And a one, two, three, top of the eighth. The two spot in the seventh. Tip it, fly ball to right field. Oh, what a what play. What a play made by Polk. Unbelievable, up against the wall. Crash into the fence, and he robs Tip it. That's a fair ball down the first base line. Parker Nolan rounds first, he'll head for second. One out double for Nolan. His second hit of the afternoon. 
That's it, deep to left center. And it's ground rule double for Cole Messina. That'll score Nolan. Gamecocks take a 10 to two lead. Boki strikes out Petri. Tip it. Retires Polk and South Carolina sweeps number three Vanderbilt. 